My name is Darren Bogan. I'm Ted Colby. And we're Cincinnati State students. And we're doing a final project for Steve Yelton's Biomedical Instrumentation 3 class. And we're going to demonstrate the basic PM for a Valley Lab Force 2 electrosurgical generator, uh, more commonly known as an ESU for short. Um, I'm going to start out and demonstrate an accessory of the foot switch control and it basically does the same as the pin control. It has a cut mode and a coagulate mode. What I'll now do is have Ted turn on the unit. And as you can hear the beep noise and the LED displays are turning on. And it starts out in the standby mode. Then we are going to select on status to ready mode. And then I'm going to have Ted also help me out. We're going to start with the cut side first, and we're going to select pure cut. And he's going to uh, adjust the manual up key to get to the maximum setting of 300 watts. And we are now at the max setting of 300. We also have three blend button selections, which are like preset and they go in about 50 watt increments. We go to blend one, it's going to drop down to 250 watts. Blend two would be 200 watts. And blend three would be 150. Okay, now he's going to go back to the pure cut mode and he's going to manually adjust it up or down depending on where you want to set. And I think eventually just go up to 300 watts maximum. Okay. On the other side of the unit then is the coag setting and there's no like blend settings or preset. Um, it's just a manual up and down, which the maximum for that is 120 watts. And Ted's going to adjust to the 120 watt setting. And as, as we're doing this, of course, we have the actual um, control is actually set for the accessory side which is for the foot switch. Okay, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go ahead and we have a pad which simulates the, the grounding which would be placed underneath a patient. We have an apple that we're just going to uh, simulate on. And I'm going to select the foot switch for cut first. And you can hear the, the beeping of the unit or the, I should say not beeping, but the continual tone. And I'm trying to, yeah, now maybe you can actually see where it's actually cutting into the apple. And of course it's kind of steaming and cutting through. And this would be used on an actual patient to actually uh, cut and like remove tissue. Um, if the uh, Surgeon would get into like where there's a lot of uh, blood vessels and there'd be a lot of um, blood Then he can switch to the coag mode and that would help like uh, coag or, or um, Cauterize like the blood vessels to stop them from the bleeding. So now I'm going to select the foot switch for coag And you can see a little bit more of the arcing of the, of the tool as it's coagulated. All right, at this point then, we are going to switch over to the actual hand control mode. And um, I'll let Ted demonstrate that. And when we're finished with that, then we're actually going to use a, uh, a test equipment to actually verify the wattage settings uh, that are actually uh, coming from the unit. 